Hurricane Fiona making landfall in the Dominican Republic Monday. Winds hitting nearly 150 kilometers an hour and battering the region with extremely heavy rainfall. It destroyed everything, this man says. Even as the eye of the storm moves out, the Dominican Emergency Operations Center warns rains may persist for two days. Puerto Rico also bracing for more rain and life-threatening flooding after Fiona left most of the island without power on Sunday. Getting service fully restored could take days in the U.S. territory that's still dealing with the devastating aftermath of Hurricane Maria, a deadly storm that hit five years ago. Unfortunately so, I have to say that uh, the hurricane and now the storm, the related storm, has impact, has covered the whole island and, it, and has impacted the whole island. Puerto Rico's governor describing the damage as catastrophic. New video coming from Puerto Rico's national police showing rescuers carrying a woman in distress. Her condition wasn't immediately known. And more extreme weather, this a look at Japan, where a typhoon made landfall. This one of the biggest storms to slam the country in years. Some 9 million people told to evacuate. Japan's prime minister calling for the highest level of vigilance. One of the first deaths reported was a man who was found in his car, the vehicle submerged to its roof. A landslide claiming another life. Hundreds of trains and flights canceled here. And the National Meteorological Agency says up to 400 millimeters of rain was expected in central Japan over the next 24 hours. Melissa Duggan, City News.